Velocity is defined as the speed at which an object travels in a given direction. The right formula to use for calculating velocity depends on a few different factors, such as whether the object is accelerating at a constant rate, or whether it is moving in a circle as opposed to a line. The most basic formula for calculating velocity is velocity v equals distance d over time t. If you don't already know the time and distance, you'll need to calculate them first. Subtract the initial position from the final position to find distance, and subtract the start time from the end time to find the time. For instance, if a runner began sprinting due east at the 22 meter mark along a track and ended up at the 52 meter mark, you'd subtract 22 from 52 to find the distance or displacement of 30 meters. Similarly, if they began their sprint at 5.35.01 p.m. and ended it at 5.35.06 p.m., you can find the time by subtracting 1 from 6, giving you 5 seconds. This will tell you that they ran 30 meters in 5 seconds, which means that they maintained an average velocity of 6 meters per second east. If you're finding the velocity of an object, that's accelerating instead of moving at a constant rate, things get a little more complicated. If you know the acceleration rate of the object, you can find the final velocity using the formula VF, final velocity, equals V1, initial velocity, plus AT, acceleration times time. For example, if an object accelerated north at a rate of 5 meters per second per second, over 5 seconds and had a starting velocity of 6 meters per second. Its final velocity would be 6 meters per second plus 5 meters per second per second times 5 seconds or 31 meters per second north. Once you know both the final and initial velocity, you can calculate the average velocity of an accelerating object. To do this, Add initial velocity to final velocity and divide the result by 2. In this case, 6 meters per second plus 30 meters per second divided by 2 equals 18 meters per second north. The method for finding the velocity of an object around a circle is a little different. To do this, use the formula v velocity equals 2 pi r, the circumference of the circle over t time. For example, an object that moves around a circle with a radius of 50 meters in 13 seconds would have a velocity of 2 pi 50 meters over 13 seconds, or approximately 24.17 meters per second.